Alas, for Yorick, I knew him well. Hear on those lips that I have kissed. O oh, lips, where be thy jibes now? Oh, we're all out of jibes today. How about some nice cabbage? <laughs> Away with thy cheap wit. Yeah. Ah, with me trusty blade shall I smite thee down. Ah! Ah, crazy Shakespeare stuff, you hit. Never will I cut out Shakespeare. Once a ham, always a ham. Ham? Gosh, Mrs. Horlick wants a ham for dinner. You better get it, boy, I'll tell you. Hello, Herman. Fair princess, for thee, a rose. Oh. Oh, where is there a happier maid? Oh, where, oh, where, my lamb? Oh, where, oh, where is there such love? There's that... Mrs. Horlick's ham. Yes. Oh, oh, Father. Uh, yes, sir, on the way, sir. Oh. Ham for Horlick. Shakespeare business. You got my daughter as to be as you. You certainly have. And this foolishness must stop. Oh, but Aunt Fanny. Oh, to, to, to stop. You must cease associating with this ham. Why? Because I aspire to play Hamlet? Makes no change your mind for what you perspire. You stop it or you spit. Why are you here? Well, I, I can I sent her. I sent her for your liver. I take care of my own liver. <laughs> I'll... Take liver pills. Take liver pills. Uh, what? What did you say, young man? I didn't say anything. Besides, <laughs> I don't eat liver anymore. <laughs> I eat dog meat, dog meat. <laughs> so, you nincompoop, you would make a fool out of me, huh? For less than two pins. I would take you... Oh, 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 o
one nose, not one foot, can they step in this house. I didn't know, sir. Oh, father! I delayed my friend to come to the party because, well, I, uh, I thought Fanny and I ought to see a little bit more of each other. Oh, Mr. Honey! Heaven! Oh. What are you doing here? There, there, I heard all about the little fracas. It was all in the spirit of fun. You, uh, you wouldn't hold that against the boys, would you? No, of course not. Go right in, Herman. <laughs> you, uh, you and Julia run along. I, uh, have something I uh, want to say to, uh, Fanny. All right. <laughs> Guess I do a little running along myself. You know, two is company and three is a poet in the class bush. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, Mr. Honey, uh, won't you, um, um, won't you sit down? Oh, I, uh, I'd be uh, delighted, Miss Lansman, here. Thank you. <laughs> oh! Miss Lansman. Oh, Mr. Honey. Uh, <clears throat> did you, uh, postpone your trip on my account, Mr. Honey? Uh, nothing else but Miss Lansman. <laughs> You can call me Fan. Oh, you're so breezy. <laughs> but I'll call you Fan if you call me. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Lansman, I am a man of very few words. Yes. I have something to say to you. Yes, yes, go on. I love you. And when do we eat? And I love you, too. I've loved you for ten years, Annie. What kind of sandwich do you want? Well, I'm glad to hear you love me, Fan, but uh, make it a rye. A sandwich with um, ham. Oh, all right. I'll do it, dear. I'll do it. Oh, Mr. Honey, I get... You loafer! <laughs> this is the last camel that broke the straw hat. Get out. Get out. Get out of my house. <laughs> Here. Good gracious, Miss Fanny fainted. What happened? Not half of what's gonna happen to you. Get out. Oh, oh, get out. oh hey, get out of here. Oh, oh, I'm so mad I could almost fight. Hello, Mr. Henry. I thought you were leaving town. Yes, I forgot some important papers. Yes, I, I, I'm seeing things. A fine mess you made of things. Well, I tried to help you out, didn't I? Oh, you helped me out all right. Right out of Julia's life. Oh, woe is me. Yeah, woe is both of us. What are we going to do now? I don't know and I don't care. Go away and let me think. Is it possible? Well, you may as well take the whiskers off. Take what off? The whiskers, you sack. Give me Ow! for nine on to thirty years. Well, Mr. Honey, it's you. Well, it's, of course it's me. Who do you think it was? Gee, I'm sorry. I thought you were Pat. I apologize. Pat! Say, what are you talking about? Well, you see, it's this way. You know, Mr. Lansman discharges, and Julie and I are sort of, well, you know. Anyhow, she's giving a party, and Pat thought because, well, Mr. Lansman wants you to marry Aunt Fanny. And, and I thought, say, take it easy, son. Take it easy. Let's sit down and let me have it right from the start. Oh, come, come on. Oh, together. No, never. The disappointment has broken my heart. Oh, oh well, now, never mind. And so we threw us both out. Say, Pat. How did Fanny like the lovemaking? Oh, great, considering I'm an amateur. But compared to your technique, boy, you dock her dead. Why, I was a humdinger in my day. I'll bet you <laughs> were. <laughs> Say, I'm speaking of Fanny. I'm not as young as I used to be, and it's about time I settled down. I think maybe I... By gum, I will. Come on, follow me. Nidwitz, <laughs> bamboozers. If I had him here, I'd take him... <laughs> Just what I ordered. <laughs> here, oh, here, stop it. You would make a fool out of me, yes? <laughs> here, what is going on here? Here, here stop If it. you leave here in one piece, it will be my fault. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Lansman. <laughs> Say, who's crazy here? Me or me? Fanny, it's me! What? Yes, Henry Honey! Oh. It is you! Henry! I'm so happy. I'm 
Fanny, I'm a man of very few words. Will you marry me? Sweetheart! Julia, I'm a man of very few words. Will you marry me? Sweetheart! Joey, I'm a man of few words. Will you marry me? Sweetheart! Oh, you got me as crazy as you are. Get out of here. And you too. Hold on. I have something important to say. I was going out of town to join a combine who wants to open a larger market than yours in this town. What? Why, that would ruin me. I know it. But now that I'm in the family, I ain't going to let you go to ruin. I've got ideas. <laughs> Sit down. We'll open a bigger and better market. Of course, we'll need new ideas, new methods, and most of all, we'll need his young blood. Mine is only middle age. <laughs> There's your young blood there. That's what I had in mind. Do you two youngsters think you can handle the proposition? Yes, sir, sure. It's a cinch. The first thing we do is attract attention. To attract attention, we'll have music. And singing and dancing. And a floor show. Terrific! Gigantic! Stupid pendulous! To, to the, the new colossal market! <laughs> Everybody is here tonight. Why, here comes Mr. Joseph Lansman with his sister and his beautiful daughter. <laughs> Won't you say a few words, Mr. Lansman? <laughs> sure. Ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's certainly such a lovely evening here tonight. I'm so glad we had this grand old thing. I, I'm so glad everyone is here, really. It's just really marvelous. I've never seen anything like it. Say, if you've ever seen like it, you've never seen anything like it. Miss Julia Landsman. <laughs> Won't you say a few words, Miss Landsman? It's all so lovely and so wonderful. And I'm so happy to be here. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Our mayor, Charlie Lawyer. Say a few words, Your Honor. Fellow citizens, on this auspicious occasion... I've never seen such a demonstration. Really, it's dazzling. It's simply, it's beautiful. It's monstrous. Ah, oh, here's that popular society leader, Mrs. Horlick, and her son, Walter. I mean, Walter. Uh, won't you say a few words? Hello. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pat, see if you can get Mr. Honey over the mic. Oh, Mr. Honey, Mr. Honey, you're, uh, you're public. Oh, dear, Martha, I'm Hello, folks, and thanks. I love it. All I can say to you, it's marvelous. Honestly, it's a marvelous place. I love it. I like it. My sister's here. My uncle is here. My aunt is here. And I certainly wish you were all here, too. In conclusion, I say, mount it to music. And then share it out of our market with joy in your heart and groceries in your basket. And now, on behalf of the stockholders, I formally turn the official opening of the grand colossal market over to those two live wires, Hammer and Pat. Good evening, folks. We bring you the latest vogue in town. That tear of the pipes and pep, that whiz-bang wisdom of the electric organ, Mr. Milton Hurt. Miss Fanny 
Landsman. Take it, Landsman. I've seen everything like it in all my life. It's simply marvelous. Come on. Let me have fun. Oh, my God. Cool you off. Yes, it is much cooler, much cooler this evening. 